If you are planning to buy the Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 and are wondering how accurate its SPO2 readings are, then you are watching the right video. In this Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 blood oxygen accuracy test video, I am going to compare the SPO2 readings of Watch 5 to a professional oximeter so that you can know how it fares against a professional medical device. Not only this, but I am also going to compare Watch 5's SPO2 readings to the Garmin Forerunner 245 Music, which I think has a very accurate blood oxygen sensor. So watch this video till the end to know if the SPO2 sensor of Galaxy Watch 5 is any good or not. COVID-19 has taught us the importance of blood oxygen saturation levels in the human body. During the pandemic, people used to purchase a professional oximeter to keep track of their blood oxygen levels. Nowadays, almost all the smartwatches available in the market can track your blood oxygen levels. In fact, it has kind of become a must-have feature in a smartwatch. Smartwatches cannot obviously beat professional medical devices when it comes to blood oxygen saturation level monitoring accuracy, but it is a good feature to have because, as they say, something is better than nothing. And smartwatch manufacturers are really working hard to make their devices as accurate as possible. So let us see how good the Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 blood oxygen monitoring is. Firstly, I will compare the watch with an oximeter. I am going to do a total of 4 comparisons with the professional oximeter. Firstly, I will do 2 comparisons on the left hand and then I will do 2 comparisons on the right hand. So let's start. I have worn the watch 5 in my left hand and the oximeter is on my middle finger of the same hand. Let's start measuring SpO2 levels. Impressive, the difference isn't much, but let's try one more time. Again, the difference between the readings of the oximeter and the watch 5 isn't much, but let's not get our hopes high. We have one more hand to test on. Now, I have worn the watch 5 on my right hand and the oximeter on the middle finger of the same hand. And here we go. Almost similar readings once again. Let's try one more time on this hand. They are again similar. So we have done a total of 4 tests as of now and every time the difference between the two devices wasn't much. Therefore it is safe to say that the Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 has a pretty accurate blood oxygen saturation level monitoring. But wait, our test is not over yet. Let's compare it with the Garmin Forerunner 245M once. So I have won both the watches in my hand and here we go. Like the oximeter, the difference between the readings of the two devices is almost negligible. So this SPO2 accuracy test of Galaxy Watch 5 ends here. Watch 5 performed pretty well in this test and it is safe to say that it has an accurate SPO2 sensor. If you like this video then do not forget to hit that like button. And also do not forget to subscribe to the channel because very soon we will be making a detailed review video of the Galaxy Watch 5. So do consider subscribing and I will see you in the next video. Till then take care.